Now, uh, countering off the uh, step back, so your third option for the defense was the footwork, right? So again, we're just in, we're in range. I can land right here. Now, in order for it to get out of range, just, as that jab comes in, it takes that step back. Now, a common um, counter punch from there, when you've made your opponent fall short, is I've, it's gonna kind of pull up that uh, opponent off balance. So a, com a, um, a great counter punch option right here would be the uppercut. So if I step in with that jab, I'm gonna have that uppercut ready right there because she's pulling me into range by stepping back and making me fall short with that jab. So we step back, bang, we, ca we catch that uppercut. We step back, we catch that uppercut, right? Now for the step back, the back foot's gonna do the work. So as soon as the jab comes in, see the right foot's gone back. She's in a little bit wider of a stance than normal, but the weight's loaded on the back foot. So when she lands that uppercut, bang, she can bring that weight back through to the front leg. And if that lands, boom, then she can reset the feet and we're back in, right? If, if, um, if the feet get too wide, if she takes too far of a step, it's too far out now to land that uppercut and gonna be off balance. So the, the step back just needs to be a little, a few inches, just enough to make that uh, jab fall short. And as the coach, you wanna make sure they can see that target for the uppercut. So right here, step back, boom, boom, good. Just come into range a little bit more. Ready, there, Bish. nice, good. Again, Bish. Bish. good, perfect. So again, I'm just giving that target as I come in with that jab to train the boxer where that counter punch should, should exactly be, all right? So there's your three options for the jab.